morning everybody welcome back to another vlog i'm currently at a spa it's called limewood um kind of near winchester and i'm about to meet Liv and we're gonna have a really lovely little spa day which i'm so excited about and i feel like it's so needed i've had the period from hell this week um i feel like it's just gone on forever like my, my hormones like pms has just been very intense so very excited to be here i'm gonna get a deep tissue massage and then we're gonna use the like spa facilities and then we've got a little lunch booked and um, they have a really cool restaurant here it's called raw and cured and it's based like all vegan i think it's all raw along those lines like really really healthy so yeah it's just gonna be like a nice reset day um so i'm just i'm here quite early actually traffic is quite bad so i'm glad i left early um but i'm just they will be here in like 10 minutes i think and then yeah i'm not sure how much i can like actually film in there but i will try and show you as much as I can and yeah I think that's it so I just had the most intense deep tissue massage of my life um so so good but honestly like you know when you get a massage and you just feel like something that's actually working so that was really really lovely and now we are up in the little roof terrace just enjoying some downtime um it's so cute up here I'll show you after I'm on the comfiest bed it's like a big duvet mattress so this is like the little roof terrace bit you can sit at and then all around here and then there's a gym in there and then downstairs is where like the pools are and the sauna and all that it's so cute <laughs> what did you get? <laughs> soup. soup and chicken oh, salad. That looks so good. Mm. And then that and pasta salad. Thank you. Good morning. So I didn't end up getting back until like 6 pm last night, so I didn't chat to you. But that was such a lovely day. I literally slept like a baby, but my arms actually really hurt today, and I have a big fat bruise on my thigh. But I think that means that the massage was like working. Massage, it wasn't really a massage, it was a deep tissue massage, but it didn't feel like that. <laughs> it felt very sore. Um, anyway, today I'm heading off to Notting Hill because I've got a big shoot day planned because next week looks like it's gonna be raining basically every single day. So I've just been trying on my outfits, which honestly putting together autumn outfits takes me two seconds. Like in summer, if I was planning six or seven outfits, It'd take me a good like hour to brainstorm whereas autumn outfits it just flows out of me so easily i'm so glad that autumn fashion is back so i have this big bag full of clothes this bag full of bags and shoes and yes that is a pair of boots <laughs> my sandal boots have come back out this year and i am just as in love with them this year as i was last or even the start of this year i also pulled this out the back of the wardrobe do you guys remember this I have not worn this handbag literally in like two years. I think, yeah, probably like two and a half years is the last time I wore it. It was literally covered in dust. But I feel like the big handbags are kind of coming back in. And I do think it looks really cute. This is like my first proper like designer. No, it wasn't. Maybe it was like my third. But it was like one of my absolute favourites. It was like one of the first ones that I got years and years and years ago. So yeah, I'm not wearing it with this outfit. But I think it looks really cute with some of the autumn outfits that I've packed to shoot and this is the outfit that i'm heading out in so it's a little two-piece from pull and bear actually which i haven't ordered from probably for the best part well actually i only ever used to get them on like asos i'm pretty sure but i did this little shop and the quality is really really nice so it's a little navy pinstripe suit the trousers are a bit long but i'm gonna just roll the waistband and pop a pair of trainers on and then the matching blazer and then i've got my weekday white t-shirt missima necklace and then astrid earrings and then i'm gonna wear my chloe trainers and just a little handbag so yeah i'm gonna pack up the car now and head off okay so i just had a lunch and i forgot to show you i'm with isabella by the way hello <laughs> um where did we go sunday in brooklyn yeah really really nice little spot in notting hill um and we've just done about three out four outfits so we've got three more to do it's very muggy, it's so but cool. I'm very excited so to be shooting Otto. And then we also had a little break and I went to Space NK. 
we got some nice bits for the house. I'll show you that when I'm back. Yeah, we're just wandering back to the car now. It's so nice in Notting Hill. Every time I come here, I'm like, I want to live here. The houses are just insane. I was at the um, carnival here last weekend and oh, yeah. you wouldn't have recognised it. It was yeah. literally like desolate. Like Never been to carnival. <laughs> Everything was boarded up. She sent me a video of where like Dalesford is and like you would not know that no, was that street, would you? It was crazy. Chaos. So I thought I'd show you what I picked up in Space NK because I got some really cute bits from Diptyque. And um, I got some bits from Diptyque, so I bought, look what I got. Is that right? Yeah, look what I got for the car. I have a little um, centre for my car from Diptyque, but I ran out of the inserts. So I picked two of them up, so we never run out again. These are so strong, like, honestly, they sent the whole car, and they're so strong that you can, like, turn the diffuser on and off. So I actually turn it off. Um like when I'm not in the car because it's so strong that it becomes like too much. But that just means that they work really, really well. So I got the base scent, which is the scent we have in the house. Then I got biggie stuff. I've got a blister on my foot and our dog, if you've got a cut or like a wound or blood, he's gonna lick it. <laughs> he's licking my ankle. And um, I still keep seeing this brand everywhere. Johnny, wait, because in here is what you need to see. I keep seeing this brand everywhere. I'm not gonna lie, I thought this brand, when I kept seeing it on Instagram, was Summer Fridays, because I feel like it's very, very similar in the branding. Um, but I got this body wash in the scent Eucalyptus. This smells so good. And I just think that's a really aesthetic body lotion, shampoo, no, not shampoo, body wash. Um, and this also comes in a fragrance free. So if anybody's got like sensitive skin, um, yeah, it's really handy to know they have fragrance freeze. Um, and then you just open it like this, which I think is like that, which I think is really cute. Smells good. And then this was the diffuser we had in the kitchen before from Citra Trudon, I think you say it. Um, and it's so beautiful, but I don't think you can get refills, but I love this. So I'm going to keep this somewhere for decoration. And then I picked up base because I feel like base is a really good autumn, like coming into autumn scent. It's kind of like heavy and like cozy and we love base, don't we, honey? Love it. So, I picked up this for us. Although, I might put this on the poof in the kitchen. Look how, okay, first of all, if you need to get somebody a gift, like this is so nice. I don't want to drop it. But it comes with the glass and the stems, and then you can get refills. So, if you run out, you'd have to buy this again. But how beautiful is that? Like, I think that would be such a nice gift for Christmas for someone. Get one for my mum and your mum. Mm -hmm. Sorted. And um, so, how pretty is that? And then it has black stems. So I'm either gonna pop it in the kitchen for the island or I'm gonna put it in the lounge on top of the perf. Maybe the lounge. That'll look nice in the lounge, won't it? Instead of the Zara one. Yeah, maybe. The little, no, the little Zara one. Not the windowsill. That Zara. The windowsill Zara. Actually, the both Zara, yeah. So that's what I bought today. And now it is quarter to four on Friday. So what does that mean? You're gonna fill that diffuser up? No, what does a quarter to four on Friday mean? Finish your work, <laughs> I don't know. Oh, Pilates for you, hon. I'm poor wine. <laughs> now you lost a bet this week, guys. No, I am trying to do Pilates. You failed yesterday, you lost. Johnny, I couldn't, That's basically, I've started doing um, Bryony Deary's Pilates. I'm gonna try and do it every day. But yesterday I had my massage and I got home at like, I left the house at like 7 a.m. I got home at 6 p.m. and I actually like could not walk. So that didn't happen, and then today's Friday, so it's not gonna happen today either. But I bet Johnny 250 pounds if I did it for two weeks, then I would. Why don't you come in the camera? I was standing to give behind. some financial, financial motivation. You I don't need out. your money. I honestly said to myself, right, when I win this 250 pound bet, I'm gonna use that cash and buy an Adenola gym set. But I actually only bought a gym set yesterday, <laughs> so I failed the bet and I didn't stick to my little rules. Anyway, that's what I got today. So I'm gonna just fill this up. because I think that looks best on this little 
bit here and then take this one away. So now it's all kind of matching. Also, this is my Beauty Pie Clean House candle. I need to clean it. But if you are after a candle, this is honestly so, so good. We have this one on at night. And then I also have this one from Joel Loves, which is roasted chestnut. It smells so good. The two of them together just like completely scent the room. Um, and this is really nice for autumn. Good morning. Um, <clears throat> I'm just heading out to see Dr. Selena to get some filler done. Not too much, but I think I just want to get my top lip topped up. Actually, I'm going to turn you around. Um, because the last two times I've gone in for appointments, I've only had a lip flip, which is Botox in my lip. So I haven't had filler in there for a while. So I feel like... You can see my top lip is a lot smaller than the bottom. So I'm going to get a bit of filler in the top lip. And then that's probably it, to be honest. I don't really need anything else. Maybe a little bit in my job, but I'll let you know when I get back. My Uber is literally about to be on my road. So I'm going to be very quick and show you my outfit. And then I'll probably just talk to you when I'm back home because it's a bit awkward filming like whilst I'm getting filler. So I'm wearing this new Zara blazer, which I really like. I have a little H&M vest top on. I have these faux leather slash like coated leggings from Le Agents, I think it's called, Le Agency. Um, Miss Mutton necklace, Ashton earrings, Gucci loafers with the fur, and then my Givenchy Antigona, which I'm obsessed with again. I think it's so cute. I don't know how I like went so long not wearing it. I used to be glued to this bag. I think I said this yesterday. Anyway, really, really love it. So I'm just wearing that. Um, and also it fits a lot of stuff in it, which is great. So I'm just gonna hop in my Uber and I'll chat to you guys when I'm back. Okay, so I got back a little while ago and now I've had a really quick uh, get ready session and we're going out for a little date night, which would be nice. So face wise, I literally just got like half a mil in my top lip. Obviously they're a little bit smaller right now, but just to equal them out, which I think looks nice. And then I also got a little bit of jaw filler just to tighten up my jaw here. So yeah, that's all I've got this time. I'll show you what I'm wearing really quickly. And then I'm gonna feed the dog and head out. We're going to a restaurant called Sachi, I think, which is a Japanese in Knightsbridge, I'm pretty sure. Okay, just a very, very simple and casual look. So this little top is from Mango. Um, blazer is pretty lavish. Jeans are a gold, shoes are a bouton, and bag is YSL. And then jewelry, I have um, Astrid cuffs and earrings, and then Miss My Necklace and Cartier necklace. I'm also wearing no mascara, which feels a bit weird. I have literally not stopped wearing these jeans since I bought them. They're just the perfect jean for wearing with heels, but then also with trainers or loafers, like any occasion. They just look so good. Such a good purchase. Just pouring a quick drink before I go out. I don't know if I've actually shown you this yet though. I know I've shown you Born Rose is like normal rose, but I don't know if I've shown you the fizzy one, which is incredible. Have I? I don't know. Anyway, if you're looking for a nice, light, fizzy rosé, this is so good. And I still have a 15% off code if you want to shop anything um, from the website. Nadia15 gets you 15% off everything. And somebody messaged me last night and said they're shipping worldwide now, I think, which is great. But yeah, I'm just having a little glass of this. Cheers, my dears. I just feel so guilty leaving Biggie on his own. I have the furball which I like like watch him and chuck him a few treats and things but I just feel bad for him because he was so used to having been here and I've been died like ages ago now I've, but still every time I leave him it makes me feel really guilty and it makes me really want him a little friend to keep him company but if we get a puppy now it means that we can't really go out for date nights and things over the Christmas period because you can't really leave a puppy alone. Well, we could, but do you know what I mean? If we got a puppy in like October, we're kind of tied to the house until like Christmas. And we just don't want to have a nice Christmas period and do all the Christmassy things in London, like go ice skating and go to Winter Wonderland. Um, because last year we were tied to the house because Beanie was sick and then the year before that, Biggie was a puppy. So I feel like we've not really enjoyed Christmas at London yet. Christmas at London? London at Christmas. <laughs> Um, so yeah, we're thinking about getting another puppy, maybe next year, but you get a bit sad, don't you? Hey, you get sad. Hello guys, so it's now Monday. So this vlog was meant to go up last night, but I didn't um, finish it yesterday. So I'm gonna just finish it today. So basically today has just been full on YouTube day. I'm filming, actually I'll show you. 
been filming this um, video here with this row. It's very autumnal, um, minus the hat. <laughs> but I basically am talking all about um, like the key pieces in my autumn wardrobe. So not so much a capsule wardrobe um, or a capsule autumn wardrobe, more just kind of like a couple hero pieces. And then shoes and bags. And I want to show you this little outfit from Adenola because I'm just about to do a Pilates session because I am sticking to doing Pilates every day, at least Monday through Friday. Don't really have to do the weekend because that's not going to work out. <laughs> but Monday through Friday, I am um, trying to do Pilates every day. So I picked up this little set as motivation. It's from Adenola. I love the colour of this. Um, and I just think it's really flattering. Just a really nice set. I also got a top that's like cropped and it has long sleeves, but I'm not so sure on that one. I can show you another day, but the sleeves aren't like tight and then the body is tight. So maybe I need to get size down. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, this is my favorite top that I bought. So just full length leggings, like seamless, I'd say in style, apart from this seam. And then the top is so nice. The material is really soft and I haven't got a bra on. And if I was gonna do like actual workout, I feel like this would not support me and have to put a bra on, but just for like being around the house. It's cute. Um, and then also, I don't know if I've shown you this yet, my little necklace, Wait, I'll turn you around. Okay, so this is a little, whoops, way too sunny. <laughs> this is a little necklace that Lauren got me from Astrid. It's a little bee. Basically, it was Bean's birthday. Um, like last week, maybe two weeks ago. And she sent me this little necklace to say she's thinking of me and him. Isn't that just the most sweet thing ever? Like she's such a sweetie. So I've been wearing this nonstop since I got it. I absolutely love it. Um, and now I'm gonna sit down, not sit down. Yeah, sit down and do some Pilates. I'm a novice at Pilates, but I'm just trying to get myself moving and actually doing exercise again so I've started doing a walk either a walk or Pilates every single day um because as I'm getting older I'm my metabolism is not what it used to be and Johnny always said to me when you hit 26 that's when things start going south <laughs> and I was like yeah bullshit like I've always had a really good metabolism like I'm good anyway I hit 26 I literally swear I hit 26 in July like a month ago and I'm like oh my god what's happening I'm so unfit I'm just like not as tight as I used to be. <laughs> like I feel like my arms are getting a bit loose and things. So I'm just really trying to work on my fitness. Um, and eventually when I am confident enough with Pilates, I'd like to start doing a class every week. But until I feel confident, I'm not gonna do a class yet. So I am gonna use Bryony Deary's um, platform. I'll just show you it. So this is the website subscription that I use. I feel like this is a really good place to start because they do a seven day free trial and they also do like intermediate beginners and like different levels. So this is a 10 minute beginner core class. You don't need any equipment for this one. So I just pop out my mat here and do 10 minutes of Pilates. I know it's only 10 minutes, but honestly my abs like ache. <laughs> Like literally ache when I'm doing this. So I'm gonna do this now so that it's checked off my list for the day. And yeah, let's do it. <laughs> literally 10 minutes I feel like okay I've done my exercise I'm sweaty I feel like my abs already hurt um yeah I just love it so my camera battery is literally flashing at me so I'm gonna say goodbye now thank you so much for watching sorry it's a day late I will see you all on Wednesday bye